All right, we're going to find the area of the following geometric figure. All right, to find this area, we're going to have to find the area of two different shapes, a rectangle and a triangle. Uh, we're going to start off by finding the area of the rectangle, this one that I shaded in here. To find that, we're going to multiply the length times the width. So 9 times 7, 9 times 7 is 63, so this is going to be 63 centimeters squared. So what I did to get the area of that rectangle in there, so I'm going to write here area of rectangle. We went length times width which was 9 centimeters times 7 centimeters which gave me 63 centimeters squared. Now we need to find the area of the little triangle. I need to find the base and it looks like I already have the height. It looks like the height is the 4 centimeters that doesn't look very clear, but I'm guessing this is the height right there. I don't have the base. To find the base, I'm going to have to subtract this and this from the 9. So, 1 and a half plus one and a half is three. So that's gonna be three centimeters. And then we're going to subtract it from the nine. So nine take away three is going to give me six. So that's going to be the base of the triangle. Six centimeters. That's gonna be that. All right, now we can use the formula for the area of a triangle. It's going to be one half base times height. So that's going to be one half times six times four. So that will be 24 halves or 12. And because it's an area, it's going to represent centimeters squared. So now we're going to take the area of the rectangle and add it to the area of the triangle. 12 centimeters squared plus 63 centimeters squared is going to give me well, I'm not sure how much that is. Let's work it out. Seventy-five. Seventy-five centimeters squared. That's going to be the area of the geometric figure by adding the area of the triangle plus the area of the rectangle. Okay.